Joe wants me to groan for you, like, like if I was to put the seatbelt on. Oh, yeah, yeah. Moving, sitting still is okay. Moving, I can steer the car. Can that's good. You can get your foot on the gas. So today was our second CrossFit workout. Yesterday we could not move. It was very hard to go downstairs. Joe told me if I made her move, she would stick a fork in my eye. <laughs> That's true. So today he took me to another workout. And Alan worked much, much harder than I did. And he did, at the point where he was doing 20 push-ups, they were perfect push-ups. They weren't like mine. They weren't girly girl push-ups where I couldn't even get down. Maybe at the end of the 20, I got down an inch further than when I started. And skipping, we had to do skipping. I could do six revolutions of the skipping rope and I got that up to 10. But because Alan's so black and white and does everything perfectly, at the end of the workout, he was jello. <laughs> I was spent. Spent? Actually, the definition of the word spent now has meaning to me. <laughs> it took me almost an hour from the end of the workout to recover enough to get up and leave the building and go to the car. I was just not, once I sat on the bench, I was not moving. And when I said it, it's time to go, he didn't even know what those words meant. Yeah, Joe said, okay, get yourself ready to go. And I remember thinking, what does that mean exactly, getting ready to go? What do <laughs> I have to do? It was like I was so tired I couldn't think. You know what's really good about that though? We have this word, if I say galoshes, it means to Alan, I'm spent and I have to go home or, you know, we have to leave wherever we are. And he, he's never understood that before, ever. And yeah. now... Galoshes. You get it, right? Yeah. What he's saying galoshes. So uh, I think we have Kate to thank for this discomfort we are experiencing. Yeah. Thanks, Kate. <laughs> CrossFit from Kate's CrossFit trainer and um, I decided on CrossFit because Kate inspires me and Alan's really happy. I think I'm going to have to work from home <laughs> because if I go to a workout like this in the morning there's no way I'm going to be able to go to work but all I can do is go back home. <laughs> After he rests for 45 minutes. Yeah this oh I'm going to go do a quick workout and then I'll go to work. Yeah all right. Like that is going to happen. Although after I've done it for a month, maybe I'll Perk up a little. I'll feel more able to do something else. Like, I mean, I'm going to get home and have a shower, and then I have to go and meet Michaela to discuss the script that we are working on. And I think right about the time I have to go to visit with Michaela, I'll probably feel energetic. But that's three hours from now. And I'm so hungry, I'm going to go home and make dinner. <laughs> I'm starving. <sighs> That's all. And it's uh, two degrees above zero in Ottawa today, at this time, according to my Do car. Do we give a shit? I, well, it's a big change from minus 22. But you know what? Alan still put his snow pants on in yeah, the gym. I'm, I'm dressed up like it's Polar minus bear. 22 outside. <laughs> Go figure. That's just the way that is. Yeah. Uh, oh, look, we're going to get an amber light. Oh, amber! And we're through the intersection. It's really pink. There. And the next one's green, too. That's all we have to say. Goodbye. Bye.